Hello everybody, it's Chuck Thunder, and we're playing a new game today. I have been kind of looking for like a business simulating game. I've played a few out there, nothing that was worth recording. But today I found a game, just kind of perusing through Steam, called Sim Companies. Um, didn't, without getting too much into it, it's basically a, a game which the, you fully simulate, you know, running a business. Um, you know building new buildings, running a store, all the stuff. So right now, the store that I run is the grocery store, and I can get things from the farm if I grow things from the farm. Um, in the tutorial, they had me grow apples from these requirements, and then sell the apples at my retail store. Now, growing the apples, I guess I own this farm, I don't really know, but I don't necessarily have the resources to make these things, so I had to go get the resources from the open market in order to do it. Um, and so once you have the uh, stuff you need, you can go and build. So just as an example, so right now I'm here again, production and sales are accelerated by a factor of three until 2.30 a.m. So there's a bit of a bonus here to get things done quickly. Um, I was given a reward of like 12,000 bucks and I had 500 bucks to my name altogether. So like they gave me like a little bit of a starting thing here. Um, looks like I can install robots, I guess, that do things automatically for me. Um, and so on and so forth. Yeah, and I can't do this, obviously, because I don't have all the things that I would need. Um, hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure if I fully understand. We're not going to get there just yet. So, anyways, so if I wanted to make, say, like, ten of these, I don't have enough seeds. I have water. Wish there's a way I can see my resources. Is there a way I can see my resources? Yeah, here we go. Here are the resources that I have. I have... 10,000 water, I have 5,000 transport, and I have 10,000 energy. Um, so I have the water, I just don't have the seeds. So I definitely need to buy the resources. Um, so I don't grocery store, make sure your stores are busy by earning money. There's only a recommendation. You're free to follow your path instead. Okay, show me how to buy stuff. Uh, okay, so it points in the right direction. So we're going to go to the exchange. And the prices and apples, oranges, sausages. Make sure to exchange, exchange calculator showing profit before buying. Make sure exchange calculator showing profit before buying. Spend about five hundred dollars. She's telling me to spend five hundred dollars. I don't know, but I, I definitely want seeds, right? And it was like a three to one ratio of seeds that you need. I said, let's say I wanted to grow fifty apples. We have fifty apples. Now I have fifty seeds. We can go back to here. What is it? Okay, type the amount worth about 500. Is it 250? Yeah. Okay. So we're buying apples. We just bought them. Now we're going to go to our store and we're going to go ahead and sell these apples. So we have 50 apples. Well, now we have 260 apples. And last time we sold them for about four, so let's, can we sell them for 450? I guess we could. Profit per unit, I'm going to get less profit per. What if I sold them for three? 350. What about for 425? What about the, for 399? Okay, so that must be like a a sweet spot there. Start selling. So that should sell stuff now. Produce or sell today. Good, we got an award. Five blue stars. Start a production. Show me how we go to the farm. But well, we also bought seeds, didn't we? We bought 50 of them. So let's go ahead and produce apples. Does it show me how many seeds I No, it doesn't show me how many seeds I have in the moment. Like, I wish it did. And apparently 
I had seeds of any type, so I just did apples again because we're going to sell the apples again. Um, but it, it's estimating how many you can make in an hour, what the wages are going to cost you per hour. So, you know, we can produce less per hour and probably charge more per orange. That's my guess. Anyways, so my personal assistant has a message. He boss, thanks for giving me the opportunity to work for you. We'll sure to prosper on your from the trip. You're welcome. That's very kind of you say. Okay, well, that's kind of cool. She kind of says things. Uh, I learned about achievements. Uh, these are the engine build three buildings, so on and so forth. We don't have any rewards to claim just yet. Um, game, show rules. This is an English speaking chat room. Okay, gotcha. So we got a chat room here. Cool. And we have a help section and a game section and chats. Okay. We open up a third one. Okay. So close this one. Help and the game. That's all we want. Okay. So, anyways, Encyclopedia, which is where we can learn everything we need to know about everything. So, oranges we know have a roughly two dollar exchange rate, and they're sold, and how they're sold, and how it's done, and we just needed to produce orange juice. If you're going to make orange juice, what kind of building level you need, and all that business. So, it takes it really far in depth. Okay. Okay, catch me to refer the game to others. Okay, I see. Cool. Hey guys, if you want, there's my link right there. Take it and play it, and I'll get some stars. Right there. Cool. Alright, let's go back to the game. I think we've kind of done that. We got these text messages coming up here from our group chats. Um, producing apples in about five minutes or so, and we're still selling. So, what else can we do with our money here? Is this our house? This is our truck line. The growth of the company. Current economy, labor costs, public change. Okay. Nothing here. So this is a bit of an idle game. It's not one of those ones that I could like stream and it will be all that exciting. But hey, what can we build in the construction lot? Okay, we could build a farm. We could build a ranch, beverage factory, fashion factory, so on and so forth. A water reservoir. That'd be nice. Just don't have the money for it, but building a water reservoir would be nice because you don't have to buy water in the open market. Um, a ranch we could probably do, but we don't have all these items that we'd have to get at the exchange. Okay. We did that. And now we're building a ranch. We bought what we needed, because we had the money. And that should be done. So now, with the ranch, we may be able to make, um, animals to sell at the market. That'd be kind of cool. So that should be done in about 40 minutes. Uh, 40% of the way there. Contracts. Completing contracts and so on and so forth. We're, we're not in this nitty gritty yet. So we'll go back to here. We got a $500 reward for being here for that. So our apples sh should be done in about 30 seconds. Uh, which we are selling apples already. I won't be right. So interesting. So this is one of those games that you're going to have to come back to. Alright, well, something fun to play, I guess, in the background of UWO. <laughs> um, grocery store, let's rename it. Let's name it the Chuck Store. Uh, okay, let's go back to here. Wouldn't we'll rename everything here. Oh, go to the exchange. Why? Why? What do I need to go to the exchange for? Okay, it highlighted for a second, but whatever. Ah, seeds. Worth about a hundred, okay. Okay. Oh, 
I guess because it finished, it wants me to do that. Okay, so let's let's do some seeds. Hit max. Okay, so it knows to do the max. Produce. All right, so we're making that now. So we can sell more apples here. We just produced 50 more apples or something, right? Yeah. Let's see, now we have more profit per unit here. I, I don't know why. Maybe because we're selling less of them? I don't really know. We can't sell them now because they've already started. Other items to the current order is finished. It's weird. So we're just an Apple selling store, guys. No other benefits. Um, can we upgrade? You will hire 100 more workers. That's what it would take. Add four more admins to my company. It'll be down for an hour and it'll finish in an hour. Sales will increase 100%. Okay. That's, it is what it is. We're stuck kind of waiting. We have three buildings. Okay, construction. We can rush this for seven stars. Okay, I see how that's important. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and rush it. Why not? I don't know how long we're going to play this game for. Okay, pigs are decreased. Um, eggs, I'm going to need to have water and some wheat, which I can't make. I'm making leather, needs to make cows. So in order to make cows, you need water and whatever that is. So yeah, there's a little bit of a limitation of what we can do here, but let's make some eggs. So we need to get this stuff at the open market. Uh, where is the exchange? We're going to buy wheat at the open market. Um, let's buy 500. We obviously have the money for all of this, but let's just do it. Let's buy that. What? Let's go back here, go to the ranch, and we can make a thousand eggs. And that'll take an hour and thirty, an hour and three minutes. Okay, so we're doing that. Well, guys, we've kind of now locked ourselves into about an hour's worth of waiting here. Um, we get reduction in sales are accelerated by a factor of three. So, I mean, this is faster <laughs> by three times the amount. Oh, boy. Okay, well, you guys now have seen how this game can work. Uh, I like it. You know, I don't mind a click and wait kind of game. But I think that'll be kind of fun. Um, we don't have enough money to open up another farm. I can see why people might have multiple farms. But, hey, maybe we'll be able to do more shortly, and we'll play this for a few days, and we'll show you guys what it looks like in a couple days, and see if what's changed. Uh, thank you guys for coming in and watching this. This is just a little bit of a short tutorial of a short game. and see how you guys like it, and let me know how you feel. Give me comments, likes, thumbs up, you name it. Take it easy.